Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel where we dive deep into the mysteries of the mind and unlock the secrets to transforming your life. Today we're embarking on a fascinating journey into one of the most powerful principles the universe operates on, the law of reaping and sowing. This universal law is so profound yet so simple that it touches every facet of our existence. It's been acknowledged by scientists, revered by ancient mystics, and even hinted at by some of the greatest minds in history. And yet, it's something that, when mastered, can bring about transformative changes in our personal world. Imagine being able to manifest anything you desire, from profound personal growth to achieving your wildest dreams. Sounds too good to be true? Well it's not about magic. It's about understanding and aligning ourselves with this fundamental principle of the universe. Albert Einstein once said, Everyone who is seriously involved in the pursuit of science becomes convinced that a spirit is manifest in the laws of the universe. Today, we're going to explore how this spiritual law works, how you can apply it in your life, and the incredible impact it can have on your reality. Whether you're familiar with this concept or hearing about it for the first time, I invite you to keep an open mind and envision the possibilities that understanding and applying the law of reaping and sowing can open up for you. Stay with us as we uncover the simplicity behind this profound law, share insights on how to effectively plant the seeds for the future you desire, and reveal how you can turn simple principles into a life-changing philosophy. Welcome to Quantum Mind. To truly harness the power of transforming our lives, it's essential to first understand the foundation upon which everything in our universe operates, the universal laws. These laws are omnipresent, unbreakable, and influence every aspect of our existence. Some of these laws govern the physical world around us like gravity, while others are more subtle, operating on a quantum or spiritual level. Yet despite their invisibility, these spiritual laws are just as real and reliable as the physical ones we can easily observe. Throughout history, mystics, philosophers and even the greatest scientists like Albert Einstein have alluded to the presence of these spiritual laws. They've recognized that there is an intelligent design at play, a kind of cosmic order that ensures the universe operates harmoniously. Among these universal laws, one stands out for its profound impact on our personal lives, the law of reaping and sowing. This law is beautifully simple. Just as planting a seed in fertile soil and nurturing it leads to growth, the thoughts, actions and intentions we plant in the fertile ground of our minds and lives determine the reality we experience. Just like a gardener chooses what seeds to plant, we have the choice of what thoughts and beliefs we sow in our minds. And just as the gardener waters and tends to the seeds with care, our actions and emotions nourish these mental seeds, influencing what will grow and manifest in our lives. The beauty of this law lies in its simplicity and its power. By understanding and applying the law of reaping and sowing, we unlock the ability to consciously create and shape our personal world. It's a principle that once mastered, can lead to the manifestation of anything you desire. Now take a moment to think about the seeds you've been planting in your life. Are they seeds of positivity, growth and abundance? Or have they been seeds of doubt, fear and limitation? Remember, the harvest you reap tomorrow is a direct result of the seeds you plant today. As we move forward, keep this principle in mind. The universe is a fertile field, waiting for you to sow the seeds of your future. In the next section we'll dive into how this principle's simplicity is actually its greatest strength, and why embracing simplicity can be the key to unlocking your full potential. We've just explored the universal law of reaping and sowing, a powerful principle that governs the manifestation of our desires and dreams. But as we delve deeper, it's crucial to understand why its simplicity is not just beauty, but also its strength. In our complex world there's a common misconception that complexity equals value. We often find ourselves drawn to complicated theories believing that the more complex something is, the more profound it must be. But the truth? The greatest ideas the most transformative truths are often the simplest. William Golding once said, The greatest ideas are the simplest. And this holds true for the universal laws that guide our universe. The law of reaping and sowing at its core is about the fundamental process of cause and effect a concept so simple yet so incredibly powerful. Think about it. Planting a seed and nurturing it into a tree is a straightforward process. It doesn't require intricate machinery or complex interventions, 
just soil, seed, water, and sunlight. Similarly, the seeds of thoughts and actions we plant in the fertile ground of our minds and lives follow the same simple yet profound process. This single seed represents the simplicity behind the law of reaping and sowing. Your thoughts, your beliefs, your actions, they're seeds. Plant them with intention, nurture them with the right emotions and actions, and they will inevitably grow into the reality you desire. The beauty of simplicity is that it's accessible to everyone. You don't need to be a scholar or a mystic to apply this law in your life. Whether you're setting goals, overcoming challenges, or seeking fulfillment, the principle remains the same. Simple, intentional actions lead to profound outcomes. So, why do we often overlook the simple in favor of the complex? Perhaps it's because simplicity requires us to look inward, to confront the straightforward truths about ourselves and our desires. It challenges us to strip away the unnecessary, focusing on what truly matters. As we continue on this journey, I invite you to embrace the simplicity of the law of reaping and sowing. Reflect on the seeds you're planting in your life. Ask yourself if they align with the harvest you wish to reap. Remember complexity is not the key to wisdom, simplicity is. In the next section we'll explore how to practically apply this simple yet powerful law in our daily lives, planting seeds for a future of abundance, happiness, and fulfillment. Stay with us. We've explored the universal law of reaping and sowing and the profound simplicity behind it. Now let's turn these insights into action. How do we begin to plant the seeds of the future we desire? The foundation of applying this law in our lives starts with the soil, our mind. Just as fertile soil is essential for a seed to sprout, a positive and open mindset is crucial for our ideas and dreams to take root. Think of your mind as a garden. The seeds are your thoughts, the water is your actions, and the sun is your feelings. To cultivate a garden that blooms with success and happiness, you must be mindful of what you plant. Step 1. Identify the seeds you want to plant. These are the goals and desires you have for your life. Be specific instead of I want to be happy, think I want to cultivate a daily meditation practice or learn a new skill. Step 2. Prepare the soil. This means creating a positive mental environment. Practice gratitude, affirmations, and visualization to nurture a mindset conducive to growth. Step 3. Water and sunlight. Your actions and emotions. Consistent action towards your goals, combined with positive emotions and beliefs, will nourish your dreams. Just as a plant needs water and sunlight, your goals need effort and positivity to grow. Remember, planting is just the beginning. Regularly tending to your garden is key. This means revisiting your goals, reinforcing positive thoughts, and adjusting your actions as needed. Patience is crucial. Some seeds sprout quickly while others take time. Trust the process and know that with the right conditions, your dreams will manifest in divine timing. This process is simple, yet profoundly effective. By consciously choosing the seeds you plant in the fertile soil of your mind and nurturing them with positive actions and emotions, you're actively shaping the reality of your tomorrow. Whether your goals are personal, professional, or spiritual, the law of reaping and sowing applies universally. It's a powerful tool for transformation, waiting for you to wield it. Next, we'll address the common obstacles that can hinder our growth and how to overcome them. Because knowing how to plant is just as important as knowing how to deal with the weeds. We've journeyed through the essence of planting seeds for our future and nurturing them with care. Yet even the most well-tended gardens face challenges, unexpected weeds that emerge, threatening to overshadow our budding dreams. In this segment, we address these obstacles head-on, equipping you with the tools to overcome them. One of the most common hurdles we encounter is doubt, those pesky weeds of uncertainty that sprout in our minds, questioning our capabilities and our dreams' feasibility. Just like a little weed, doubts can start small, but if left unchecked, they can grow, consuming the energy and resources meant for our aspirations. The key to managing doubt is recognition and swift action. Acknowledge these feelings but don't let them take root. Instead, reinforce your belief in your goals with positive affirmations and visualizations. Another obstacle is fear of failure, a formidable weed that can prevent us from even starting. Remember, every successful journey has its share of setbacks. Instead of fearing failure, embrace it as a valuable teacher. Reflect on what it teaches you, and use these lessons to refine your approach and strengthen your resolve. Procrastination is yet another weed, often rooted in overwhelm or fear. It tricks us into delaying our actions, waiting for the perfect moment. Combat procrastination by breaking your goals into smaller, manageable tasks. Start with one small action each day, building momentum and confidence. 
Lastly, let's talk about the weeds of negativity, whether from our own internal critic or the voices around us. Cultivate a garden of positivity in your mind. Surround yourself with supportive relationships and consume content that uplifts and motivates you. Remember you have the power to control the environment in which your dreams grow. Just as a gardener doesn't hesitate to remove weeds, be proactive in tending to your mental garden. Regularly assess your thoughts and the influences around you, pulling out those that don't serve your growth. Overcoming these obstacles is part of the journey. It's not about avoiding challenges but learning how to navigate them with grace and resilience. By acknowledging and addressing these common hurdles, you empower yourself to keep moving forward, ensuring that the seeds of your dreams have the space and nourishment to thrive. Remember, the garden of your mind is fertile ground for the life you wish to create. It's up to you to cultivate it, making it a sanctuary for your dreams to grow and flourish. Stay with us for more insights on nurturing your mental garden for success. As we continue our journey, embracing the universal law of reaping and sowing becomes more than just a practice, it becomes a way of living. In this segment, we'll explore how to integrate this powerful law into your daily life, ensuring that every day is a step towards the future you dream of. To truly live by the law of reaping and sowing, start by making conscious choices about the seeds you plant every day. These aren't just the big dreams or goals but also the small thoughts, decisions and actions that fill your day. Consider a plant. Each leaf, each bloom resulted from careful, consistent nurturing. Similarly, your daily habits, the books you read, the people you spend time with, the thoughts you entertain, shape the garden of your life. Begin each day with intention. A morning routine centered on positive affirmations, gratitude or meditation sets the tone for a day planted with seeds of positivity and purpose. Visualization is another powerful tool. Spend a few minutes each day visualizing your goals as already achieved. Feel the emotions associated with that success, joy, gratitude, fulfillment. This emotional connection waters the seeds of your dreams, accelerating their growth. Accountability plays a crucial role in living the law of reaping and sowing. Keep track of your progress towards your goals. A journal can be a valuable tool, allowing you to record your thoughts, celebrate your successes, and reflect on areas for growth. And remember, the law of reaping and sowing isn't just about personal gain. It's about the energy you put out into the world. Kindness, generosity and positivity are seeds that, when sown, create ripples of goodness that return to you in ways you might never expect. Integrating the law of reaping and sowing into your daily life transforms how you navigate the world. It empowers you to take active control of your thoughts, actions and feelings, aligning them with the life you wish to create. It's a journey of constant growth, learning and blooming. I encourage you to reflect on the seeds you're planting daily. Cultivate your garden with care, love and intention. Remember, the beauty of your tomorrow begins with the seeds you sow today. As we draw closer to the conclusion of our journey together, it's clear that the law of reaping and sowing extends far beyond the confines of personal achievement. It's a universal principle that influences every aspect of our lives and the world around us. Throughout this journey we've explored how to plant seeds of intention nurture them with purposeful action, and overcome the inevitable challenges that arise. Now it's time to reflect on the broader implications of living in harmony with this powerful law. Consider for a moment the ripple effect of your actions. Every kind gesture, every word of encouragement, every act of generosity plants a seed not just in your life but in the lives of others. These seeds can grow into forests of change, positively impacting communities, environments, and future generations. The law of reaping and sowing teaches us that we are not isolated beings, but interconnected parts of a greater whole. The energy we put out into the world, be it positive or negative, will inevitably come back to us, often in ways we could never predict. As Florence Scovel Shin once said, The game of life is the game of boomerangs. Our thoughts, deeds and words return to us sooner or later with astounding accuracy. This timeless wisdom reminds us of the power and responsibility we hold in shaping our world. Today I invite you to embrace the law of reaping and sowing not just as a strategy for personal fulfillment, but as a guiding principle for living a life of purpose and contribution. Ask yourself, what seeds am I planting in the garden of my life? How can I sow more seeds of love, kindness and generosity? As we conclude our time together remember that the journey of reaping and sowing is ongoing, it's a path of continuous growth, learning and giving. By aligning our actions with this universal law, we not only enrich our own lives but also contribute to a world brimming with abundance, harmony, and beauty. 
Thank you for joining me on this journey. May your garden flourish with the fruits of your intentions, and may your life reflect the beauty of your dreams. Until next time, keep planting, keep nurturing, and keep believing.